let's update that. Update the Facebook. All right, and let's get stuck in. I've got to start my timer. All right, where is back out? Um, all right, time to start this workout, guys. All right, little circuit we're going to get stuck into. All right, so the first little circuit we're going to do squats, lunges, sumo squats, high knees, and arm circles. All right, so as you can see, I don't have much room here. Um, basically means there is my the point I'm trying to make is that uh, you know time and space shouldn't be restricting you, um, nor should equipment. So if you want to join in, you know, jump up out of your chair and hopefully we can get some people on Twitch, you know, just getting a little bit done during their day. All right, um, so we're gonna start off with the first little circuit. All right, so timer's on with squats. Make sure your chest is up, just coming down. Make sure the knees come out nice and wide as well. I don't wanna see any buckling when you come down like that. Well, I'm not gonna see it, but you guys will see it. And as you come up, pushing your hips forward, squeezing your butt. All right, trying to keep the back nice and straight. Bum goes back and then comes up. Coming up to the 30 second mark as per my timer. Nine, 30, okay, lunges. Stepping forward and then pushing back. Stepping forward, pushing back. Trying to push up using the middle, middle of your foot. I'm getting out of breath. It's hard to talk and do it at the same time. <laughs> pushing up using the middle of your foot. Okay. Pushing your hips forward as well. Four, three, two, one. Sumo squats, same as normal squats. The wide stance, toes and knee go, no, knees go out and bum comes more down than back. Okay. So my bum is coming up and down. My legs are sore because I did train legs today. But, no excuses, I'll do it, as long as you guys are doing it. Three, two, one, good. High knees, now, so this one's nice and easy, okay? Make sure you're not swinging your hips too much. Bringing the knees up, using your core to control. Make sure you focus on breathing. 10 more seconds, this is a nice easy one. After all the leg stuff. Four, three, two, one. Arms out, just little circles forwards. At the 15 second mark, you're gonna go backwards. <clears throat> 13, 14, 15, and backwards. All right, just a little bit of work on the shoulders. Front rear delts and the rotator cuff, a bit of strengthening. Okay, that's one set down. Got a minute rest now. So basically, um, I'm a personal trainer from Melbourne. I like playing games, so that's what a lot of the time on my channel is going to be spent on. But I think that exercise is important. And it doesn't take that long, you know, so what I'm trying to get people to do is take 30, uh, 30 minutes out of their day Doesn't matter where you are in the world, you know, it could be 10, 10 o'clock at night um, Five in the morning, whatever if you've got time to sit, you know sit on the computer or whatever Spare half an hour get up do some stuff with me and if you enjoy it And you're seeing a difference or just having fun doing it at least once a week or once, you know you know, I'm, I'm going to be doing it five days a week, twice a day. Um, then yeah, share it around and hopefully we can get something changing on Twitch or something. That's my that's my hope. All right, we're going to get going now. Squats again. So what you want to do, breathe in and on the way down and out on the way up. 
Make sure you keep those feet nice and strong, planted into the ground. You can see I've got no shoes on. I don't know if you can see that. I don't have any shoes on. You don't need to have um, the best footwear if you're just doing body weight. That's 30 seconds. Lunges now. Okay. Make sure you're not coming all the way down and bouncing off the back knee on the ground. And if you start losing your balance because you're getting tired, like I am, just step out a little bit to the side. Nothing wrong with that. Opens up your base support, makes it a little bit easier. But you're still getting the lunges going, keeping yourself moving. Just make sure you're pushing those hips forward as you're coming down. One more. Swing my squats. I'll turn the side on for these guys so you can see the hip movement. <sighs> Make sure you're fully locking between reps. So I'm not just pushing my hips forward, it might look like it. I'm actually just squeezing my butt. It forces your hips to straighten completely. And what you do is you're teaching the front of your hips, the back and your glutes to synchronize. Good movement for your body. High knees. So I'll be doing these workouts twice a day, like I said, as well as, I should move back a bit so you can actually see me, as well as my own workouts, which I'll be doing at the gym, but you guys won't see those. So, I'm getting all that done, and I'm sure you guys can spare a little bit of time to join in with me here. Arm circles, yeah. Keep moving around if you like. I like to keep moving around and backwards. Just because my legs are getting heavy. And if this is the first exercise you've done in a while, you might already be tired. There's no worries about that, you know. Just don't give up. Have a little bit of rest if you need to. I've got a minute rest now. No shame in having a little bit of a rest in between your sets. Or even halfway through a set. Um, got to find a sweet spot for that because you can't really see my feet and you'll have to see the ground a bit later. That's all right. I think that was 30 seconds. Oh, that's 30 seconds now. Okay. Water is good. Stay hydrated. Hopefully you can hear okay. 10 more seconds. Two more rounds of these. So if you've just been watching so far, get up, give it a go. This time around. Squats, let's go. And do these one side on this time. And I'll do the sumo's front on. Make sure those knees are strong, hips back when you're doing normal squats. Three, two, one, good. Uh, lunges, keep forgetting. Lunging forward, keeping the chest up, pushing your hips forward. Pushing back off the middle of the foot. So when you come down and forward, the front foot should stay flat. Back foot should end up just on the toe. Make sure when you come forward in a lunge, you don't roll, roll up and lift your heel. Sumo squats. <sighs> Boom. I don't mind these guys. These are a good booty worker. I wish my camera had a better range. You'll be able to see my feet placement. So they're facing outwards that way and that way. And then the knees go out wide. High knees, control, keeping the chest up. So 
some of these exercises might look a bit funny on me. Reason is, you can see the top part of my leg, my femur, is exceptionally long compared to my torso. That's why it looks funny. I've got a funny looking body. <clears throat> Luckily, it doesn't affect my personal training. And these guys. Uh, circles or whatever you want to call them. Five more seconds. <clears throat> and backwards. These will be recorded and they'll be on my Facebook, uh, Facebook page and YouTube channel once I fix them up. So make sure you check those out. Um, and hopefully when, if anyone from Twitch checks this out, I can get exercise added as something because I can't put it under anything. So I'd like to get it recognized. Um, just so like, I don't know, I'm not looking to change the world, but you know, if I can help affect a few people's lives, that's the plan. So I know a lot of people have come to me and said they don't have time or money to do anything. This is free guys. You know, if you enjoy it enough, obviously donations and whatnot are uh, appreciated, but you know, bottom line is it's free and it's free to follow someone. So follow it and check it out and you can have fun. I want to talk to people in between my sets. I want to get bored. Squats again. <clears throat> tight core. Keep those abs nice and tight. <clears throat> so the next set we're going to come into is going to be glute raises. So we're going to be working the booty a little bit more. Push-ups and then a little bit of ab stuff, which we'll go through when you see it. And I don't have a mat, which kind of sucks for me, but it's all right. I'll do these guys back here so you can see how I'm trying to push my hips forward. <clears throat> Hopefully you can hear me back there and the floorboard isn't making too much of a ruckus. <clears throat> it's a bit squeaky back here. Whew. Good. High knees again. <clears throat> so I do try to control my leg on the way down instead of bringing it up and just dropping it. <sighs> 10 more seconds of these. Oh, getting sweaty. It's a bit high in my room. But it's all good. Can't complain. Having fun. <clears throat> and don't get me wrong, I'm not like one of those crazy gym guys. It's like, oh, exercising is great. It's so much fun. You know, it's not. If you're doing it right, it's not fun. But the results are fun. And the chemical reaction that gets released in your brain is also fun. <clears throat> so it feels like crap at the time, but afterwards you feel phenomenal. You feel great. And then six months down the track, you feel even better because you've done something really good for your body. And that is all your body asks for is a little bit of effort. <sighs> okay, so like I said, big set, glute raises, push-ups, crunch hold, ankle taps, leg kicks. So I'm going to bring this guy down there. And you can have a look. We'll move that. Have a look at my floor and my shoes. I'm just gonna sit down here and we're gonna wait for another 25 seconds. Oh. Gonna have a bit of a stretch while you're down here as well. I like this one. Pushing my knees down, keeping my chest up, tight core. Everything tight core is so important to engage your core because what it does is it's not gonna give you like six pack abs, but you're gonna help support your spine doing other movements, it reduces your risk of injury. Okay. Glute raises, simple, hands on the floor, pushing the hips up, squeezing your butt. Try and keep your heels close to your bum, squeezing, 
Okay, and guess what? Type core. This one's really easy. I like to keep the easier exercises for the end because no one wants to do hard stuff after doing easy stuff and getting tired anyway. One more. Good. We've got push ups next. Okay, push ups. Everyone knows how to do push ups. Do them on your knees if you like. Heels in the air if you're doing them on your knees. Hit them now as low as you can. Make sure when you do a push up at the bottom, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Help support your back. And I haven't done too many push ups since I had shoulder surgery. So I'm going to struggle with these. Okay. Crunch hold is my next one. Okay, this one's really easy, but hard at the same time. So you start up, rock back, and just balance in a V between the top part of your leg and your body. Just balancing, this is really good for your erector spinae, which is the innermost layer of your abs. Once again, won't give you a six pack, but will stop you from hurting your back. Okay. Uh, next we've got ankle taps, chin on chest, shoulders off the ground, just touching the ankles, okay, side to side, nice and easy, 10 more seconds, breathe in, out, good, and leg kicks. And I'll do this this way. Hands under your uh, tailbone. Just kicking your legs. Again, chin on chest. What chin on chest does is it engages the top part of your abs, as well as working the lower part when you do something like this. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Whew. One minute rest. <clears throat> Once again, uh, don't forget to follow my channel. There's also below, you can see those, Twitter and Facebook links. And if you're actually on my channel, you go down, there's a button for YouTube as well. You can click any on, on any of those buttons and they'll take you to the places you want to go to. Um, YouTube will be where all these are uploaded, as well as some, some will stay on, on Twitch uh, channel. Um, but yeah, hopefully we can, we can make something happen. And, you know, if you, if you're one of the first pe people involved with something like this and does become something, it becomes special and it'll be special to me as well as you, because I'll remember those who have been there from the start and, um, you know, helped, helped make a difference. Okay, glute raises again. Uh, hips up, squeeze the butt, control down. Up, squeeze the butt, control down. So we won't do as many as these because you do want to focus on squeezing at the top. You can probably see I'm holding for a couple of seconds when I do get to the top. I love doing these ones because they're so relaxing. Thirty seconds. Oh, I forgot what we're doing. Push-ups. I love push-ups. So far. If this can be my second workout of the day, surely it can be your first if you really want it. And if you're in America, I'm pretty sure it's late at night. So why not do a workout in your house and then? Go to bed. Suits me. I'd love to do that. I wish there was someone helping me exercise that late at night. Especially on the days I haven't done anything. Because once you get started, you get a guilty feeling if you miss out on things. You know? Your brain gets used to having that release. The stress relief. You know, all that. When you do these, try to keep your hands behind your legs. Don't touch them. <clears throat> if you're losing your balance, you know, unless you're gonna hurt yourself, just let yourself roll down to the ground and start again.
10 more seconds. You can do it. Keep going. When I say that to you guys, I'm saying it to myself just as much. Ah, uh, leg kicks. Keep my legs down there because I'm sure no one wants to see my ugly feet. Makes it harder for me, but that's okay. I don't mind. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. One more round of these guys and we're done. So close, don't give up now. Push through to the end. One minute rest, one more round, and done. Easy, didn't take that much time, probably about 20, 20, 25 minutes. I'm sweating. I've done a workout already today. You know, I'm pretty knackered, but you know, for a lot of people, it's, it's, it'll be hard work. All right, glute raises. Oh. I don't know if the timing was right there, but we're gonna go anyway. And my head's going under my bed. <laughs> if there's anything you'd like to see, or any questions you'd like to ask, I will be doing a Q&A at night time. I might also be playing games at the time, but I'm going to be more than happy to answer questions. But if you do have questions and you want to put them on the YouTube channel, that's comments. That's 30 seconds. Uh, Push-ups. If you want to put them on the YouTube channel as comments, I will also make videos and answer your questions. So, don't hesitate to ask questions about exercise or nutrition or anything you want help with in the area. All right, crunch old. Make this long. Maybe you should man bun it. I'm gonna go quiet for a bit, just focusing, because I don't want to give up. Three, two, one. There we go, and leg kicks. I'll do these, maybe on an angle this time, just so you can see what's happening from a different angle. There we go, that's a bit better. Now I have to look at my feet too. Up close and personal. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and done. Ah. Let's fix that up. So as you can see, I am sweating like a crazy guy right now, but it felt good. And you know, if this reaches one person and they give it a go, that's fine by me because that's what, you know, getting one person out and doing something is, is, is better than none. Um, but if that one person likes it, share it with your friends because it might affect someone, you know, one person in your life. <clears throat> but that is it just a quick stream to get this going um but yeah don't forget to have a look down there twitter facebook youtube check them out um you might find something you like and don't hesitate to ask questions in the comments of anything and next time um in our one minute breaks you can ask questions in the twitch chat if you're on the twitch channel Roughly 2 p.m. every weekday. Um, and I might be looking at doing one around 7.30 p.m. Australian Eastern Daylight Savings Time. <sighs> Thank you. See ya.